after I pray for you, expect connection with the job that you are doing. You hear me? Mm. Expect a connection. So because I saw you doing, she saw plumbing, 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 but there's a delay. You hear me? So after this, this connection that God will give you, expect your business to grow. In Jesus' name. There's a brother here. It's not long you got a job, but there's a job coming. It's this one. Yes, come here. It's not long you got a job, but you're not happy about it. Huh? So you want God to give you another one? Yes. You've received another one. God bless you. Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ to viewers all over the world. Welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Sunday life service and uh, the leadership of Apostle JB and Prophetess T. E. Makanenisa. And send with me here today is my brother who was located during the service by Prophet Andres Simono who ministered upon his life. Sir, kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. Oh, my name is Tonal. My name is Mabunda. I came from Tembisa. Today during the service, Prophet yes. Andrews located you and spoke to you. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Uh, Professor Andrews prophesied me about the, the, uh, receiving the, a job. Uh, last time, one prophet, what did I, uh, can I receive a job? So, where, where I'm working, not there, but I'm not happy about the job I'm working. So, they said to me, I received a job. It's not the first time. Thank you. And how long have you been trusting in God for a better job? Uh, I, I trust. I do trust God because I, I have two years where I'm working, but I'm not happy. So I trust God. I, I, I receive a new job. Yes. And how do you feel that today, Prophet Andres located you and declared that a new job is coming? Uh, I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm, I'm more than happy. There's a brother here. Come here. I pray for this company that you want to register. Come. Oh, my God. Is that the wife? Is his wife? Because he's delaying himself, this man. Sometimes when you're working, you're delaying yourself. Come here, mama. The spiritual husband must leave you. Come on. You demon, come on. Come on. Brother, what is this thing in your stomach? Huh? Brother? Hey, hey. Bring that small boy, come here. Bring him here. There's something here. Huh? My boy, look here. There's a pain here. Huh? Sometimes it goes down to a wrong place. This pain must leave you. Come out! Come out, you demon! Look here, what are you doing in Clayville? It's where I, I, rent, I rent there. It's where you're renting. Yes. You're going to move. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Right, sir. Can you please tell us your name and tell us where you come from? My name is Flanky Chaoke. I'm from uh, Clayville. Prophet Andres located you and spoke to you. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Okay, he told me that uh, I'm what I'm doing at Clayville, I say I'm renting there. Then he said to me, I'll move where I'm staying. Yeah. And how long have you been trusting in God for moving? Ah, it's been long. Even today, when I was sitting there, I was thinking about that. You see, hey, I want to move where I'm staying. Because right now, um, I need a, a, a place because I want my wife to be free. When she do things, she must not look, ah, this, that one, like that. Yeah, I want her that she must honor that house. Yeah. And how do you feel that today Prophet Andrews declared that God is going to bless you with a house? I'm very happy and I'm blessed today. Amen. Amen. Don't believe what the doctors told you about the kidney problem. Amen. You hear me? Amen. Did he t you tell your wife? Yes, I did. Mm, don't believe what the doctors told you. Uh, it's just a spirit. Amen. Why all of a sudden? Huh? Why all along you're fine and now you're married? They say, no, you've got a kidney problem. God has healed you. That kidney Amen. is gone. Life, sir. Can you please tell us your name and tell us where you come from? Uh, my name is James Arapatalo. I am from Soweto, Protea. Prophet Andres located you and spoke to you. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Uh, today I am happy uh, because the man of God uh, prophesied me. Because I have been in doctor, the doctor said 
I have a kidney kidney problem. Then the, the man of course say no, it's, it's just a spirit, it's not a problem. I'm, I'm here today. I'm here, I'm here. And how do you feel that today Prof. Andrews located you and ministered upon your life? No, I'm here. It's what I wanted to hear from, from God today. No, I'm here today. Come on. Mama, you, your feet. Please, leave those feet, you demon. Come on. Come on. Come on, you demon. Huh? What are you doing those feet? I can't hear you. Huh? I can't hear you. You're saying what? You want to kill her? Yeah. Huh? Sister, you're building rooms. You? Huh? Yes. yes. You're building rooms? Yes. Mm, I, I hear that there's a land that is coming also. You know, uh, more, you're saying what? Put egg. Yeah? Put egg. I can't hear you. Put egg. I can't hear you. I said put like one tolerable. Why demons love to insult us in the church? She must suffer. We're in the church, we're not. Yes. Now we love us come and tear now. Huh? Tear. Tear. You don't see you are in the church. What's this? I need to ask you to bring up a phone line interview. The whole year she was waiting for interview. It came. Yes, yes. God is, God is not a liar. Yes, yes. This Come week, on. she will receive a call. Nazva. So free. Talking about the rooms. What disturbing. Life, ma'am. Please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Michelle Matewel. I'm from Pretoria. Prophet Andres located you and spoke upon your life. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. He said to me that I'm building rooms, so I confirm that uh, there's a rooms that I was building, but I just finished them. So he said there's a land that I will build another rooms. So I bought another house in Mafikeng. I want to build the rooms there. Yes, so I confirm being true. And how do you feel that today, Prophet Andrews located you and ministered upon your life regarding this? I feel very happy because I was struggling when I was building the other one. So I know that those ones is going to be easy for me when I'm building them. Brother, you want to forgive or you want to divorce? Forgive. You want to forgive? Yes. God bless you. Amen. This is life, sir. Kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Tiani and I'm from the Pompo. Prophet Andres located you and spoke upon your life. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. All right. You just said, um, do you want to forgive or you want to divorce? And then I said, I want to forgive. So I understand um, why you asked me that. It is because, you know, um, when in marriage you're facing some difficulties and all that, you come to think of maybe you have made a wrong decision and all that, you see. So, but I'm glad and I, I just want to confirm this uh, prophecy to be true. I'm, I'm, I'm glad because I did not know that I have not yet forgiven. So, but that prophecy at least has brought a light into my life. So I bless God for that. Yes. And how do you feel that today, Prophet Andres located you? Uh, I feel very, very good. You know, it's, it's so amazing how God operates. You, you come expecting this and then you get another thing. But you know, all things work together for good when it comes unto the Lord. So I'm, I'm, I feel so much blessed. Sister, Mama, you've got people that are monitoring you. You hear me? Yes, Mama. The, the, the spirits that are monitoring you. Do you have a Mercedes Benz? Yes. A sky blue. Yes. Small like this. Yes, yes, prophet. Mm. You've got a spirit that is monitoring you. <clears throat> and I want to tell you that whatever that they are planning against you, it don't work. Amen. 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 So they want to kill you. Amen. You hear me? Yes. But prophet. the blood of Jesus will save you. <clears throat> I want to tell you why. Because there's no one that has ever been like you in the family. Yes, that's true. That's the problem. That's true. And you they are, are fighting me. You are coming from a traditional family. That's true, man of God. You know, because I see this car here. I see this boy sitting. And from there, I see you sitting here. You're speaking on the phone. 
this boy is sitting here. There are people that are trying to, I don't know what they're doing on the car, as if they're cleaning it. <laughs> you know, so you need to be careful. Okay, man, I've got You remember when you went to a place like a garage close, and you took a car away, they went to clean it. Yes, yes, huh? yes, mm. yes. Because I see you here, facing this way. I see this boy sitting on your left-hand side. Yes. Huh? Yes. And you are talking on the phone. Mm -hmm. And the car is right on your right hand side, facing this direction. Yes, yes, so, that's true. You see, they are monitoring you. I'm also monitoring them. <laughs> amen, so amen. God, Thank God, you. God must protect Thank you in the name of Jesus. Amen, amen. In Jesus' name. <laughs> You're free. My life, ma'am. Can you please tell us your name and tell us where you come from? Uh, good good afternoon. My name is Susan Boweni. I come from uh, Lipompo, but presently around Pretoria. Today during the service, Prophet Andres located you and spoke to you. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Uh, Prophet Andres uh, located me and he prophesied to me that uh, I'm being monitored. There is monitoring. There are people who are monitoring me and also that... Um, I'm coming from a family which practice uh, traditional, a practice tradition instead of, 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 of believing in God. I confirm this to be true because uh, I've been uh, having differences with my family because of my beliefs. So uh, he also prophesied to me that I must uh, prophesy the car that I'm driving and also uh, told me that Jesus is with me and I will be blessed whether my family likes it or not or whether my enemies likes it or not. And that as they are monitoring me, Jesus is also using him to monitor them. So he confirmed to me that, uh, assured me that I, I won't die because Jesus is with me. Amen. Amen. And Ma, how do you feel that today Prophet Andrews located you and spoke upon your life? I'm, I'm, I feel, I'm so happy. And th this, when he said this, uh, monitoring my enemies, I confirm this to be true because I've always been seeing him uh, with me in, in dreams. Sometimes I will see myself, and he once uh, prophesied to me that uh, uh, they've put something on my stomach. The very same week I saw him with me, uh, assuring me that Jesus is going to operate me. And indeed, I think an operation uh, uh, took place because in the morning I was feeling very, I was healed. So I know that when God is using him to, to, to he's, my, he's, he's, he's using Prophet Andres um, to, to pray for me or as my uh, guardian angel. I don't know how I should put it, but I have seen him a number of times in my dreams where he was uh, saving me where I had to undergo operation, but it was it even assuring me that it's not going to be painful. So I thank God and I thank um, Prophet Andres for having located me and even uh, 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 told me what uh, my enemies are planning. And uh, this, it's another thing, it's, I know it's true because always when I get into the car, uh, I just feel like there's something, you know, which is about to happen always when I'm, I'm driving in the car. So I confirmed everything that is, uh, is said to be true. And I thank God for, ex for exposing everything through him. Uh, Jesus is coming for you. I can hear you. Amen. Amen. What are you doing here? Huh? I want to kill him. What are you doing, this man? I want to kill him. You want to kill him? Yes. Huh? Yeah. I know you. <sighs> you are a spirit of, of somewhere. I know you. <sighs> Why do you want to kill him? We don't want him to see huh? it. We don't want him to be successful. I can't hear you. We don't want him to get a job. You don't want him to be successful? Yes. Why? Huh? Why, why you don't want him to be successful? Because he has seen our things. He has seen your things? Yes. What are those things? Tell me. What is that? 
We have been doing things back at home. Where it's coming one? from. You are saying one? <laughs> things that we've been doing. I can't hear you. Things has been planted where it's coming from. Mm. Yes. So it's busy, it's busy every day. Who are you? What is your name? Forefathers. You are the forefathers? Yes. Bring him, let's set him free. Set him free. Leave him, leave him. Leave him, leave him. Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ, viewers all over the world. Welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Sunday life service under the leadership of Apostle JB and Prophet T. E. Makananisa. And with me here today is my brother who was located during the service by Prophet Andrew Simono who ministered upon his life. Sir, can you please tell us your name and tell us where you come from? I'm coming from Ivor Park. Prophet Andrew located you and spoke upon your life. Please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Yes, Prophet Andrews allocated me because there is something inside my stomach. Yeah, every time I was feeling pain, but I don't know this coming, the pain that's coming from. Sometimes I feel like I, I will able not to sleep. Like these things, it was painful. So today, by the grace of God, the Prophet allocated me and he told me about uh, this. He knows actually who's doing this kind of uh, things. So you deliver me today. How long have you been experiencing these pains and how have they affected you? Uh, this pain has been there. It, it comes, actually, it comes and goes, comes and goes. It's been like, I don't know how many years it's been this pain. Yeah, it has been affecting me in such a way. Even no matter sometimes when I go to, uh, to the uh, uniting, I find that, okay, after uniting, I've, uh, the blood is coming out. But today, I think I'll, I'm free forever. Amen.